everybody. Thanks for stopping by my channel today. Uh, this video today is going to be about graphic tees and inspirational tees. And this will tie in with a video that I had just done on inspirational jewelry. Um, I think graphic tees are a fun way to dress, fun way to send a message to others and inspire others as well as yourself. So I've got a couple here that I wanted to talk to you about. Uh, they're, and because it has been in the below, actually it was below zero this morning um, here in Maine. I mean, it, last time I looked it was one degree. So it's such a cold and frosty day. I was going to try wearing one of them, but I just can't do it. I, I've got a flannel shirt on, and so I'm going to show these to you as opposed to wearing them wearing them. So here's uh, the first one I wanted to show you. It's a new company I just discovered online. It's called Ruby's Rubbish. And this is my first tea I have gotten from her. I loved the message. If you can see it, it says, Be Brave. Uh, be in black with the, the arrow underneath and Brave in a beautiful gold. I got this on a gray t-shirt. You could get it in like a cream. And I bought it a little bit big. I bought it a size bigger. Um, it looks like it's fitted well. And uh, it's a very, very soft cotton. I love that. And the inside of it says, Life's what happens in our tees. Um, and this is a medium. Usually I take like a small in women's um, or an extra small depending on the company. Um, and in the back of it, you've got on the top, of one shoulder in that same gold rubies uh, with birds on it like birds on a line and then rubbish underneath it so you've got a little bit of their logo on the back and it ties in with that same gold on the front I love it um, I was going to talk to you a little bit about styling this and as you can see uh, hopefully you can see instead of knotting it in the front which you can certainly do and is definitely trendy and easy and actually knotting a t-shirt in the front has been going back since as far as I can remember like the 50s and 60s uh, like with a pair of jeans but I knotted this in the back for just a different look so uh, I think it's cute it pulls it in in the front makes it a little bit more fitted and knotting it in the back is just another cute look and this I thought was so cute um, you could definitely wear that with, to the office and that's what I love about these inspirational shirts is I intend to wear them not just casual uh, like with a cute pair of jeans but also to the office and I wanted to show you this uh, with a jacket or a sweater over it in a traditional office you could easily do that and let me show you what I'm talking about so here is a skirt this happens to be a J. Crew skirt that I got, I think, a couple springs ago. I love this uh, gold zipper that goes up the side. So this is a nice pencil skirt with an asymmetrical zipper that goes right up the side. It's lined. Um, it's you know J. Crew. What can I say? They do everything very well. So this T-shirt I thought would go cute with it because it has that same gold on the word brave which ties in with that zipper. So you see, it's got the same colors. You could certainly tuck this in. You could not leave it knotted in the back. And you could put over that a cute little sweater uh, or a, a navy jacket. And I have a navy blazer here somewhere. I'm not sure what happened to it. But uh, this is something that you could cover up with a navy jacket inside the office or certainly black to pick up the black lettering and then when you go outside on your lunch hour or after work uh, take the jacket off and you've got a fun look so um, again very practical that can be worn inside or outside the office and I love the message be brave everybody be brave in whatever it is you're facing in life whatever you're doing uh, I think everybody is facing a challenge in some sort um, almost every day of our lives and no matter what your challenge is whether it's financial um, you know marital your children your job um, whatever it is 
um, I think it's a great inspirational message to to be brave in whatever life is throwing its way so its way at you. So love that T-shirt and Ruby's Rubbish again is the name of that company. Um, another T-shirt that I just recently got, which I thought was so fun, and actually I'm taking this to my daughter tomorrow. Um, this is from again one of my favorite companies, J. Crew, and I thought this is perfect. This is. Greetings from Maine. It's like a little postcard on a t-shirt and it's got all these things that represent our beautiful state. Everything from whales, uh, the chickadee, the pine cones, you've got lobster, sailboats, and of course our beautiful shape of our state of Maine. Um, even though we're in the single digits today, I still love my state. It's such a beautiful state. So, love this t-shirt. Um, it's a lightweight cotton, and again, I bought this up just a little bit bigger. Uh, J. Crew t-shirts tend to run, I think, quite small. So my intent with this to wear to the office was with this cute white A-line skirt. It's lined. It's just above the knee. It's got a couple little uh, false pockets there in the front. Just a simple, cute cotton sh skirt, and then. I would wear this t-shirt with it and to wear it in the office I have this great and this again is J. Crew from last spring this gray sweater that has this uh, white piping uh, that I thought would go great under the shirt tie in the white and the navy and the white skirt so there you can see all three of the colors and in the office, button this up, and nobody's going to know what kind of a message uh, that you've got on your t-shirt underneath, or what your shirt is. Um, but they tie together beautifully, all three of these colors, gray, navy, and white. And what a fun thing to do. And let's face it, as the days get hotter, you want to wear as uh, layers still. You're still layering, because in the office it gets uh, cold. And so I'm always wearing a jacket or a sweater. And I love these lightweight button-up cardigans. And this is a lightweight merino wool from uh, J. Crew. And I have, over the years, I try to get a new one every year. And I just keep this, uh, and it's so easy to throw on going out the door in the morning. And then on my lunch hour or after work, I can immediately take it off. And I've got a cute little t-shirt and a cute skirt to go with it. So those are just a couple of the looks that I, that I had in mind there's so many different looks I, I went into my wardrobe and I pulled out like a dozen different outfits uh, that I could make with just those two t-shirts so of course you can always wear them with jeans uh, with a little shrug a little black shrug over it and um, you know they and shorts I mean they're, they're just perfect for everything so that's it um, again please follow me on Instagram with pie uh, I did indicate that I was going to be doing something on these graphic tees for you. And thank you again for stopping by and being part of my beauty community. I really enjoy this. Please thumbs up if you like this type of thing. Um, please comment below. Please share with me what your favorite graphic tees are and where you get them. And uh, I will try to link below the name, uh, the link for Ruby's Rubbish. Uh, so that you'll be able to see the type of t-shirts I'm talking about on their website. Um, I'll also try to think about, see if I can get a J. Crew link on some of those cardigans that I like, those button-up little uh, wool cardigans. So again, please, uh, please subscribe, please share, and I appreciate you stopping by and taking interest in me, and have a wonderful day. Bye now.